The focus of the vaccine rollout so far has largely been on over 70s, but it's also included nearly 200,000 young people from across the UK who are classed as extremely clinically vulnerable and who've been shielding for much of the past year. Daniela Ralph has been hearing from some of them. The day you get your first vaccine, when you're 22 years old and have been shielding on and off for almost a year, is a big moment. Do you want to come away down here? It's quite emotional. Um, I'm, I'm very excited about it, but it, it does really mean a lot to me. This is your vaccination card. Today you're receiving the AstraZeneca vaccine. After Trudy, you'll get your seat. Hope Stevens has Crohn's, an inflammation of the digestive system. She spent months thinking about being here in the vaccine centre, getting her jab. Feeling more emotional than I thought it would be. Um, I don't think I realised quite how much of a big step it could be. When a young life has felt so restricted for so long, the vaccine has brought a major shift in mood. A significant day for me, um, and it's given me a lot of hope, really, that, that soon things might start to change for the better. Fionn here. As you all know, there are police out and about. Fionn Gwither is 24, an actor, and has Down syndrome. During lockdown, she's dressed up to lift spirits. Right, you laughed. You are not listening. Amongst the first to be offered the vaccine, she's recorded every step of the way. If you offered the vaccine, go and have it. What difference do you think it makes having the vaccine? What did it mean to you to have the vaccine? It means that we can move on and think what we can do in the future. I was thinking I was excited to have it and how lucky I am to have the vaccine is that early. Atatutu Ojo has lupus, a condition that affects the immune system. She was worried about having the vaccine at first, but did some research and changed her mind. When I went to the vaccination centre, there was definitely a positive vibe and people were sort of, you know, I could sense hope. Definitely looking to getting into a better position than we are now. Just want to do things that make me happy and do things that spark joy. For all these young women, the first vaccine has offered the promise of a fuller life ahead. Nothing to be worried about. Go and have a job. Daniela Ralph, BBC News.